Before we start, it's very important for me to show everybody some of the foundations of this practice, such as the starting position, the ending position, as well as how we hold our body, hold our tongue, hold our perineum. Okay, so the first thing, the tongue, the tip of our tongue, you want to stick behind your two front teeth in that gap in there. So this, what it does, it connects our ren, du meridian, which is our ren, is the front conception vessel. Du is the back. It's a back major, the governing vessel. So when we connect the two with our tongue, bridge tongue, we become a whole body, okay? So whenever we practice, we try, even when we breathe in, we breathe out. Try to stick your tongue at the top uh, of your, behind your two front teeth. Okay, and number two, whenever you breathe out, you relax the perineum. You breathe in, you suck up your perineum, almost like Kegel exercise. So you're like pulling water from the earth, pulling nutrition from the earth. Okay, number three, the starting posture. I'm going to show everybody how the starting posture is. I would like to show everyone the starting position. Relax, breathe in. Breathe out. Now step sideways. Now your feet and shoulder is shoulder width apart. Slightly bend your knees. And now I'm going to show you how the tailbone is supposed to be. So when we start bend our knees, a lot of people does this or does forward. So instead of doing that, think about our tailbone has extension down. It's like a root system. So we are actually on a tripod. Our two feet and our tailbone form the three root system, like a tree. So the tailbone, you want to push in a little bit, so almost like sitting on a little chair at the edge of the chair. So it goes down like this. And this time, you lower your chin a little bit, so there's a straight line between the vertex of the head and the tailbone. So here is a posture of starting posture. So in posture, we practiced, and we want to collect all the good energy back into our bank. So Chinese TCM thinks about this belly button area over here. On top and not, especially on the bottom, one hand width, here is our energy storage area. I call it our energy bank. So after our practice, we will bring all the positive energy, everything we did, back to our dan tian, dan tian means the red, the field for the red bead, okay? So you get all, all of the energies and go down over here. It's the second chakra, actually second and first chakra over here. So you store your energy in your second chakra area. And that's our bank. So that's our closing energy, closing posture. Now I'm going to demonstrate each posture as well as the thinking of thoughts behind when we are practicing. So many times we go to the gym, we see everyone with their iPod on and their practice. So they're going through the motions, but without, if you're thinking about what you're actually doing, it actually enhances our practice much more. So I'm going to tell you guys uh, how I think when I'm practicing and hopefully it will enhance your practice. So the first posture I'm going to do is raise up two hands to the sky to regulate our san jiao or triple burner. So in China, we believe there are triple burning in our um, center of our body. One is a top burner is for heart and lung regulation. Middle burner is stomach and spleen, and the lower burner is in our belly button. So by regulating this triple burner, it help our with our modern metabolism and help our transporting of all the nutrients and energy through our body. So the first one, we are going to think about doing that. And also when I'm practicing, I think two very important things uh, to keep in mind. Number one is we are part of the nature. So we are connecting our human body is actually connecting heaven and earth. So we, I always think that earth is a mother and heaven is a father when they come together and create us as a human. And we have the ability to connect heaven and earth. 
so within the center in our heart space so this is what i think about when i'm practicing number two is you know those gerbil balls uh, with a mouse inside with a sphere outside so i think i have a sphere with the diameter as spread on my wings wingspan so i make a sphere so whenever i practice a stretch i try to stretch as far as i can to the circumference of this sphere and you can expand this sphere even to um, as you practice to bigger and bigger okay so this is our energy ball or energy sphere so i try to go around the circumference and so this helps me stretch and help me be centered now I'm going to demonstrate the first posture. Two hands hold up the sky to regulate our three gel or triple burner. Feet spread, shoulder width apart, knee bend. Think about root system, the, the tripod with the tailbone slightly forward sitting on the edge of a bench with our chin look down a little bit our vertex and tailbone one straight line breathe in breathe out breathe in breathe out breathe in Breathe out. Now straighten up our knees. Two hands below our belly button. Crisscross. Raise up to our heart level. Flip over. Press upward. Press up the sky. Now lean the head back. Look up the sky. Stretch your neck muscle. Get rid of all the tightness from our computer and sitting and doing the iPad and iPhone. Look straight forward. Hold and stretch. When you're ready, soften your knees and spread our wings. Go down. When we spread our wings, you want to stretch this whole in, inside or medial side of our arm. Just stretch. Inside the medial side of our arm, we have our lung channel, our pericardium channel, and our heart. So it helps with our heart and lung, which is the upper gel, the first gel. So when we do this, again, we hold up the hand, going up. Flip over our heart level, stretch up, look upward, stretch our neck, feel so good. Look forward, you can spread our wing a little bit here, just spread. So you feel the stretch, soften our knees, and open our wings. Remember, stretch the medial side, our arm down now our thoughts is collect water from the earth mother collect the water or the yin from earth mother bring it to heart level with love flip over and present in a tray to father heaven where earth and heaven can connect and create within us so we connect heaven earth and stretch with appreciation and then soften our knees, open our wings to the circumference of our energy sphere, our gerbil ball, and come down, breathe out. So this is the first posture. And when you're done, you open up your wings, you collect all the energy you have, and back to Dan Tian or lower abdomen, second chakra, your energy bank, and breathe out.